Police in Australia say they've disrupted another terror plot. This one was aimed at people attending Veterans Day, one of Australia's most important holidays. Investigators say the plan was ISIS-inspired, and as Jackson Prosco tells us, it was alarmingly simple. The arrest took place in the pre-dawn hours in suburban Melbourne, shattering the early morning silence. Oh, just a lot of racket around 4 o'clock in the morning. The smashing of glass, um, men heard yelling, and then saw like flashbangs going off. Hundreds of officers swooped in, arresting five young men, including an 18-year-old accused of being one of the ringleaders of an alleged plot to attack police during Australia's National Day of Remembrance for Armed Forces. He's alleged both men were undertaking preparations for a terrorist attack at an Anzac Day activity in Melbourne, which included targeting police officers. Symbolic targets for a planned attack which investigators say was inspired by ISIS. Please don't be deterred. A turn up in the largest possible numbers to support our country, to support our values, and to support our armed forces. According to authorities, the accused are all associates of another teenager who was shot by police after stabbing two counter-terrorism officers. But this was not a sophisticated plot. Police seized a knife and a sword. These types of attacks that are planned are very rudimentary and simple and as we've said before all you need these days is a knife, a flag and a camera and one can commit a terrorist act. Australia has been rocked by homegrown terror in recent months as it confronts the threat of the so-called Islamic State. In December a lone gunman held 18 people hostage in a cafe in downtown Sydney and more than 100 Australians are known to have joined ISIS fighters overseas. Australia's terror alert remains high, and authorities say this latest plot was disrupted in its final planning stages. The teens had been under surveillance for some time. Individuals acting by themselves. They are not representative of any religious, cultural or national group. The country's National Security Agency is juggling 400 counter-terrorism investigations, worried more attacks could be in the works. Jackson Prosco, Global News, Washington.